Philippines DND should provide regular updates on acquisitions like Malaysian Defense Ministry, the Deputy Defense Minister of Malaysia, Adli Zahari reported recently to the Malaysian public that the progress of the contract for the FAR-50 Light Combat Aircraft or LCA that they bought from South Korea or SK is now 27% complete. Two aircraft will be delivered in the third quarter of 2026 while the remaining 16 units will be delivered in batches until the end of 2027. These aircraft are also set to undergo a midlife upgrade program to enable them to serve with the Royal Malaysian Air Force or RMAF until 2055. Malaysia signed the contract for these aircraft last year in 2023 for around US$920 million United States dollars for 18 units or around $51 million per unit. These FA-50s for Malaysia have now also been designated as FA-50M, similar to how the FA-50s bought by the Philippines were designated as the FA-50PH, it is good that the Malaysian Defence Ministry provides such detailed updates to their citizens on a regular basis, I think that it is something that the Department of National Defence or DND of the Philippines should do so also. The DND does provide updates also on the Philippines' defence acquisitions, but not at the level of detail where they provide the percentage completed like what the Malaysians did. I think it will help the public be well informed about how their money are being spent. Notice also that despite the fact that they haven't received the aircraft yet, Malaysia already announced plans that they will be upgraded, and for how long they intend to have them serve with their air force, something which I haven't seen the Philippines do yet.